I'm going to start the video here by showing a difference between the first build and the second build here. If you haven't watched the first build video, it's not that big a deal because now it's obsolete. Uh, this is the original one that I built uh, on the Tiny Hawk frame. As you can see, it's it's performing nicely. I mean, look at it go. It's it's flying. You know, it does some tricks. It's got lift. It got it's just a little bit of washout every so often. But uh, when you're coming out of something, that's where you're going to see like there, boom, washout. Uh, you come back into something and it's a little unstable. You're not moving very fast. You've got too much weight for these 0802s. So now we move into the new build automatically. You see we're going a lot faster. You see there's a lot more loft in each of these tricks here. Um, you've got more control over stopping and coming out of a swoosh. Yeah, see that? Boom. You got the threads at high speeds with control instead of having very little control at high speed. Uh, you can almost stop on a dime until you hit something like that. <laughs> but uh, I'm going to have a uh, like a little crash reel here coming up in a second so we're gonna see the difference between like hitting a bunch of shit and how this doesn't react to you know just fall out of the tree here we go here's the crash reel um, we're going to see how much easier it is to compensate and just do things like this like boom look at that uh, you're gonna just feel the control immediately it's almost like a, a more float oriented flying style where you can do these high long orbits you can dodge between obstacles and such the other one just had so much mass to it that it couldn't compensate for its own weight and you just hit something and bounce off of it and see not be able to recover similar to how you just saw there but um okay we're gonna get into the build video here and you'll see in a minute okay well today i just wanted to share another quick build video with everybody. Um, I finally got it all sorted out and got it to be a, a decent product again. Um, this is a lot more performance oriented than the last one. So we have similar parts if you watch my other build video. Seam board, get that out of here. New motors, 1002s, 23.5 and flywoos. Uh, 1002s, yeah, 1002s. Um, and we got the same frame we got another Tiny Hawk 3, and then if you don't have a Tiny Hawk 3, then you just want the screw kit, spare parts. Yeah, there we go, now it's focused. Uh, this is probably a couple of bucks, I'd say under $15 for those. Uh, this was 80 Canadian pesos, and I forget how much these were. I think they were 14 bucks a piece from the website I order from. So you take all this crap, and you jumble it all around, and then you get one of these. Uh, we'll get to some flight footage quickly. Uh, one of the main things I want to talk about is how easy this one is. All you got to do is there's a plug that comes with this after you solder on the power. Uh, and ground and connect that little battery plug there um, you plug in if you want to you can use the little three wire harness and that's the positive ground and video and then you can just solder the three together for wires only instead of having to use the pads it uh, helps a little bit because I think the solder pads that you'd need otherwise are down there hiding underneath there on the bottom so instead of having longer wire you can just uh, run what's in there and tape off the other ones that's how i've had this on all my frames for this board so uh, i don't have any problems with it malfunctioning or losing reception or having the wires break on a crash i've never had the wires break on a crash just make sure that you solder them up good enough and everything here is nice and easy oh sorry i forgot the camera run cam nano 4. um aha uh -huh, that kept you around for a little bit because it doesn't matter you can use your own camera you don't care uh, you just need to know what the board and the motors do, and you know what this frame is. So, okay, well, there you go. That's, what, 2 minutes, 30 seconds worth of quick, uh, easy, tell you what you need, and let you do it yourself. Okay, have a good one. Bye.